is the energy vibration reading for the Ophiosa Sun, Moon, Horizon sign. Hello, my darlings. My excuses for the love readings. I'm sorry I had to break and I didn't want it to uh, upload the rest before. I wanted to just upload everyone reading at the same time, but I had a medicine problem. That was uh, and my excuses for not putting out your love reading on the first ladies and gentlemen please share 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 connect with me open up connect with me whatever the issue is and the situation is in love in this month we're going to be looking at it we're going to be looking at what is going to be affecting you ophiosis remember check out the sagittarian readings and share 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 this i'm not going to say what the reading is all about because there's just so many different aspects of love and situation and issues that is happening i do energy vibration reading the psychic energy vibration love reading so i'm not going to tell you that is this you just have to find my channel and then um choose which love reading because there's just so many of us and so many things that is happening again i love you guys let's check out please like and share these video um these are these are um these are um for public <laughs> okay so um let's see what's coming in so we're calling them cupid the angels of love to show us what is coming in for the ophiosis okay so we see past love coming in for you ophiosis we see karmatic um you're having karmatic issue with a past love or a past relationship okay so you could be in a relationship that is um, a lot of uh, situation that you need to work out i'm seeing um new love coming in okay i'm definitely seeing new love coming in there is um past love that has effect with money so there could be divorce that is coming up destiny um some of you are in a karmatic um love relationship and it was destined and this is with a um a chocolate brown man okay so a new love is going to be coming in this is a chocolate brown man who is coming in as new love for some of you bam 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 beautiful females i am seeing that you are being invited out some of you if you were looking for a man that is financial stable he's going to be here i'm seeing true love some of you could be in a relationship this is a karmatic relationship but this person have true love for you i'm seeing children coming up so all the people who are going to be dating this new love this chocolate brown man he has already have children he could get you pregnant so be aware because this person um that's how people hold on on you they get they get you pregnant so be aware of that now there's a lot of legal issues that is happening so be aware i'm seeing some of you could be meeting someone who is a lawyer or a public servant um in high position yes um this is a woman you um working woman could be meeting a chocolate brown man but he has a lot of kids back up back up back up don't take on these people with their whole lot of kids sorry i have nothing against that but girl you're a working woman you have no time for all these kids short-term relationship is coming up with a um this could be that you have dated a lawyer or it could be a lawyer out there you're going to be a meeting a true love but it's going to be short term um it's as if you had to heal whatever um that was happening between you and this person it's coming from a past life open um open relationship is coming up for the business people so you could be a business man or woman and um you want to have open relationship with other people these are people who like to have group sex and that sort of a thing so that could be something that is coming up okay some of you your mother-in-law is going to tell it as it is okay this person is slick okay whatever that has transpired between you and your partner your mother-in-law is going to be telling you as it is 
she is going to be cutting through and it doesn't have to be your mother-in-law you could be in a relationship with someone but she's gonna cut through the BS she's gonna find out what is going on And these are mature people like you mature women and men are here in the reading. So I'm seeing you going through and cutting through to find out what exactly is happening. Because some of you, your intuition is telling you something. Or you're going to be seeing clearly a situation that you have never seen um, clearly before. You're going to be having wisdom and understanding because you're going to be seeing clearly a situation that was a bit clouded for you. You're going to be finding out what exactly is happening. You're going to be, you know, cutting through your wisdom. Some of you, um, there is going to be some detachment. Some of you find that your partner is very cold and detached. Some of you are going to be finding yourself having um, having a uh, crush on an older man. Or you may have a relationship with a older man. And you're sharing his life with his wife. But he's sharing wise wisdom for you. Okay, he's sharing wise wisdom for you. So let's go in and look at your reading. So new love is coming in for you guys. Some of you are dealing with a chocolate brown man. He could be coming in as a new love or it could be just um, someone who you know, but it's a karmatic relationship. So whoever this chocolate brown man is that you're um, connecting, whether via um, new love, it was destined to happen. Okay, it was really, really destined to happen. I'm seeing past love is coming back and that was destined to happen. It could be people who you have had children before you have divorced or you had a, a, a child with this person. They move on. You move on. They're coming back in your life. They want to be a part of your life. I'm seeing money coming in and uh, all of a sudden wake up to this, ladies and gentlemen. Some of you were dealing with someone and this person was very cold. But it was because um, of m money issues, okay? It was because of financial issue. Now, girlfriend, boyfriend, if you're dealing with someone and they're cold because they don't have any money, hey, bullshit. It is all about materialistic stand, okay? So if someone is cold because they don't have any money or they're financially in strain or you're fin and they're being cold to you, Leave them in their coldness, okay? Because that is no relationship. Relationship is based up on being there for each other. If one don't have the uh, uh, one don't have the other can help. If you're just being cold because you don't have any money, and this is no relationship. It's all about money. Move it. Um, just let this person go. There's no true love. True love, bullshit. Some of you are going to be um. Some of you businesswoman. Um, you're going to be meeting someone and they're trying to tell you that they're their true love, but it's all because you're financial stable. Okay. Lies. This person is just looking for someone to, um, to be financial stable with. Okay. Lies. Okay. So don't let them fool you. True love is coming in and people are using the name of true love to connect with other people. Okay. I am seeing some of you mature women, 45 years and older, meet a brown, um, a chocolate brown man. And he's like, I'm your true love. You're my true love. Hey, you're going to cut through the bullshit and see that he's just BSing. Okay. So you mature women, lawyers, profession. And so you're going to be finding out that someone is trying to play you. So if you're a businesswoman, very professional, you're running your own business or um, let's say you're a doctor, a lawyer, um, some eye profession, you're going to be cutting through the BS because you're going to be finding out that someone is just fooling you and you're going to cut it down as it comes up. Okay. I'm seeing a lot of text messages, a lot of communication. 
okay but this is just short term so some of you could be realize that your partner is always on the telephone texting and SMS it's just part it's just for temporary because whoever they're in their their um, SMS it's just for temporary and um, these people are not really serious with them so <laughs> whatever they're doing or whatever the, the, the other people are having fun in their lives and they're thinking whatever let me just text and just uh, let you you know that is what is going on so and I'm seeing that some of you men who are married and have a family and is seeing someone young you're gonna be finding out that the person has been soulmate 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 damn 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 soulmate what is happening soulmate and the chemistry there is a strong magnetic attraction chemistry yes this is your soulmate okay so some of you whatever is happening <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay so if you had a question if someone was your soulmate because you're feeling a strong chemical attraction Boop! it's your soulmate okay all right um all right let's put them back and see if they come out so a soulmate okay soulmate something about someone out there trying to find out if someone is their soulmate yes yes okay all right I gotta go with my reading okay so past love some of you are dealing with some past love and they are in your life because of money okay whoever this person is that you're connecting they would have never connected with you if you didn't have money or you had start status so deceptiveness oh my god oh my god oh my god <laughs> okay all right so uh that one is clear for you guys that one is clear for you guys so someone is the past karmatic situation and it's is it was destined to happen because whoever this person is is very deceptive because if you didn't have a nice house a nice apartment or you know you had a good job or good profession this person would never connect with you they only connect with you because you were professionally um, strong you had your house you had your car this is the reason why if not this person would have never connected with you deceptiveness okay you love yourself first I don't know what is happening but some of you this new love is coming in as a chocolate brown man and love yourself first whoever this person is just choose yourself first okay I'm not saying that it was destined for this person to come in but um, your self-respect makes you more romantic and attractive so this chocolate brown man could be just coming in and trying to connect with you um, just for the sake of sex so love yourself first don't give it away whatever it is true love is here this is the romance of a lifetime so some of you beautiful women are going to be meeting a very rich man um, this man is financial stable and um, this is really true love and you were destined to um, meet okay so you beautiful woman okay make the effort now some of you chocolate brown men you need to make the effort to go and see your kids okay I'm serious I'm, I'm, I'm just serious here it is here it is you make all of these kids and leave all of these kids all over the place you need to make an effort and go and see your kids whatever the situation is you need to make the effort and go and see your kids okay it's coming up in a love reading because you're making all of these kids leaving them all over the place these kids are without um, fam, um, fathers okay separation is coming up so divorces is, is coming up divorces is coming up time apart from your partner is on the horizon time apart from your partner is on the horizon whatever is happening there is separation between you and your partner okay get to know each other so I'm seeing that some of you business women are going to be meeting someone whoever this person is they have kids you need to get to know the person before you jump in bed with this person okay just get to know this person 
let your friends help you I'm seeing a lot of you are chatting with people on date sites get off these dating sites and go and ask your friends if they know via 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 someone who is looking for a relationship get off these dating sites because there's just crazy people um, on there heart to heart conversation so I'm seeing some of you women mature women um, or you want an open open relationship um, and it could be people um, lawyers doctors you want to open a relationship because and some of you are going to be connected with someone but it's just going to be for a very short time okay it's just going to be for a very short time so whoever you're connecting with it's just going to be for a very short time I'm seeing some of you mature women needs to um, you know let people know that it is all about art to art conversation okay it's all about art to art conversation and you know whoever this person is just um, be careful past life deception it has to do with money again so some of you needs to um, uh, yeah custody some of you needs to pay money for your kids okay just just you know you make them you need to take care of them because other people have to pay taxes to take care of them and I have nothing wrong but I think that if you decide to have a child until the age of 80 you need to take care of your own children okay some deception with someone who is paying out money to their uh, to their partners and the children are not getting it the secrets are going to be coming out some of you are dealing with a Pisces and it's a karmatic relationship I'm seeing that you need to have self-respect okay yeah Pisces here she is some of you are going to be meeting someone this is going to be a new love whatever is happening definitely a Pisces a Pisces woman 45 years and older some of you are going to be meeting this person is coming up as new love there is lies and deception in a relationship and it has to do with money so some of you are in a relationship and whoever you're uh, connecting with and you feel as if something is wrong about this it's all about money this is the reason why the person because money is there and they're being very very deceptive about this issue that's kind of nasty I, I don't know why people are like that um, some of you are connecting with someone and this was destined I think that some of you are going to be meeting a true love especially your be you beautiful um, people are going to be meeting a, a really 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 people between the ages of 25 to 45 you're going to be meeting your true love and this is so beautiful okay yes um, some of you um, people between the ages of uh, 25 and 45 you're going to be meeting the love of your life you're some of you are going to be getting married to this person this is so beautiful some of you um, um, are dealing you women uh, 45 years and older you need to make the effort okay um, you need to really make the effort get to know this person whoever this person is you need to get to know this person okay I'm seeing some of you are going to be cutting through the BS of other people and realizing that people have been very deceptive I'm seeing some of you turning your backs to a, um, a Pisces woman 45 years and older and you're looking for better avenues okay so you're letting this person go heartbreaks um some of you you you're with your kids heartbreaks coming up for your kids heartbreaks um a pregnancy you might be losing a pregnancy okay some of you um are going to be cutting through the bs with a pisces a pisces some of you are dealing with a pisces what is happening with you guys and pisces some of you are dealing with a Pisces and is going to find out the truth about the Pisces that the Pisces is not very honest. Separation between you and a Pisces. So expect this coming up. Okay, there's going to be some separation between you and a Pisces because you're going to be finding out that they have been deceiving you and you're going to be you're going to be using the source of truth to cut through because you know that they are hiding something from you. So whether it's a Pisces man or a Pisces woman, I'm seeing you get into the bottom of something because you know that they're being very deceptive. You feel it. 
um, the way they react, your, their energy, however, that you know that something is wrong and you're going to be finding us out. And I'm saying, you know, congratulations on finding it out. People must just be bloody honest to each other. If you know that you have feelings for someone, you leave someone else and let them try and find their way out instead of your being there, very, being very secretive and deceptive because, and, 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 you know, that's when people fall on their faces and sometimes people fall on their faces and people treat people certain way after a relationship is because of lies and deception because they realize that um, someone have been playing them for a very long time okay and and that's like the worst thing and then the other person is going to be thinking because it's like Pisces people never see this they just they, they just uh, they're just pissed when they're caught okay um Pisces people will carry secrets for for a lifetime, but when they're caught, they're just pissed. Okay, that they're caught. They're not pissed about oh you felt or how you felt very disregard for how they could treat someone. Because I think and and there's so much things that is coming up for Pisces. So a lot of you Ophiosis, check out the full moon reading that is coming up. Some of you are dealing with Pisces people. There is a um, Pisces, another Pisces, um, another energy of Pisces. So a lot of you are dealing with Pisces people. Some of you are going to be separated from them because you're going to find out the BS that they have been doing, that they have been shady, not being honest, that there was they're in a love triangle. You're in a love triangle with them because you're going to be finding out. And that is it. I love Pisces people, but in relationship, they're very shady if they're not being honest. Okay. So be aware of that because you're going to be finding out something. Now, you business women, mature business women in business, you're going to be meeting a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. This is a young Virgo. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. Okay. Again, the cancers come up. I'm seeing some of you texting. Um, some of you are going to be meeting a cancer and texting back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I'm seeing communication. It's via via. You're meeting a cancer. Uh, again, um, short term. Some of you are going to be meeting a Virgo, and this Virgo is this Virgo is um, a short-term relationship okay you need to have a, a heart to heart talk with this Virgo it's gonna be very short term okay some of you um, you need to have a heart to heart talk with a Capricorn um, some of you need to tell a Capricorn that you prefer to have an open relationship. So whatever is happening out there, I'm seeing some of you need to have an auto art conversation with a Capricorn, because if you don't do this, I think it is a soulmate or a twin flame. If you don't do this and they find out about you, they're going to separate. You have no return. And whoever you are going to be moving on to, they're going to drop you within three months. So you know, in order to keep this relationship, because some of you are not being honest and whoever this, this, this Capricorn is, they're going to be finding out that because they, you have a relationship with them. Um, and they're going to be finding out because I'm seeing separation coming up and you are planning something and you're going to fall in what you're planning. Cause some of you are in a relationship with a Capricorn and the Capricorn, you don't understand Capricorn people. Capricorn people, you know, they analyze everything. And they will find you and take pictures of you so you can't say it wasn't you. Capricorn people, last people to mess with in relationship. Because if, when Capricorn people is in a relationship with you, they focus purely on their relationship. Nothing else out of their relationship. And I think that you and this person is twin flame or soulmate. But whatever the issue is, is that whatever you're not working out, you need to co communicate. And as you communicate, you need to work on this relationship. But you're not looking to work on this relationship. You are looking... Um, to, and, and they're going to find that you're deceptive and they're going to cut you off for good, not even a hello. And you're going to fall on your face. Um, I'm seeing a lot of you fall on your face and whoever you leave that Capricorn for, they are going to be leaving you for someone else. And I'm seeing you 
because of the hurt that you left a relationship and went with someone and the relationship didn't work out, you're going to be hurt your entire life. Okay. And I don't see whoever you are going, going to have a relationship. You're going to be old and alone because you do that thing to a Capricorn. I don't know, but earth sign people, especially when earth sign people are really, truly, honestly in love with you and you mess them up because earth sign people are like, so they will be pissed off, but then they will like, you know, it's for the best. Bye. You know, they will be pissed off or, and, and, and that is it. It's not the, it's not the big things that hurt the, 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 the earth sign people is the small things is the line is the, like they, they felt as if something was wrong and you just keep on lying, lying, lying. That is what pisses them off. So, um, please like share these videos. Let me know what is happening, how it is affecting your life. I'm saying namaste until next time.